Here at St. Vincent College in Latro, Pennsylvania, it's one of the most anticipated days of the year for the area. Why? Because for the second time in four years, the Pittsburgh Steelers return as defending Super Bowl champions. While rookies and newcomers were trying to decide what essentials to carry from their homes to their dorms, veteran linebacker James Harrison was concerned with a more pressing issue, like becoming environmentally friendly. Hey, fit. I like my new rod. Hey, I like it. No, it's, it's a little comfortable in there. But with the return hey, to a college campus walk. comes the return of hot-blooded rivalries, both young and old. You got to win. You got to win to return at the top. If you ain't winning, it's kind of hard to return at the top. You know, last year, anybody who understands football know that, you know, we lost a lot of guys on offense, and, and they brought in a new offense, and we just didn't get it done. Um, had one of the worst seasons probably in Michigan history. Um, so this year, you know, with him recruiting these guys and having the guys in the right spot, I, I definitely believe we have a chance to go out there and compete this year. So um, all we can do is wait and see. San Antonio might have a problem with that Texas hat. Is that, is that okay with you? <laughs> hey, you, you know, San Antonio, uh, he may have a problem with it, but I, I doubt it. Uh, he, he understands, you know, it's, it's my school. Uh, I'm going to rep my school. He reps Ohio State. It's a mutual respect. Is there some camaraderie there between the two of you? Uh, it's a mutual respect. Uh, you know, he, he's going to support his team. I'm going to support mine. But uh, anytime, you know, the teams come around on TV, uh, I'm pulling for Texas and he's pulling for Ohio State. I definitely played against a lot of guys in like the senior bowl game and uh, college all-star games. So uh, it, was, uh, it was funny when I first came here because Nathaniel DB from uh, Virginia Tech, he was actually my, actually put me as my roommate too. <laughs> uh, it was a guy we went, we went to battle for a week straight in senior bowl and and we just were cussing each other out. Even though we were on the same team, on the Senior Bowl team, but practices was a totally different story. And, uh, you know, we, gave, we, we became close after that, and it was just fun, like, looking back on it and noticing the rivalry. Biggest game of the year is against Ohio State. You're a linebacker. How do you stop a guy with such great athleticism like Terrell Pryor? I'll tell you what, you know, being the biggest game all year is Ohio State. What makes that game a big year is depends on the records of both teams. Um, it's not a big game if, if Michigan's not winning. It's not a big game if Ohio State's not winning. Uh, but the way you stop them is you got to have you got to have a, a great defense like the Pittsburgh Steelers. Uh, that'll definitely stop running the quarterback. Well, I, th I think a lot of the rookies are uh, feeling that pressure because you're enemies and you're in the same conference or you're in the same division. And, you know, you go against this guy and you guys have been battling for four years. And it's just one of those things like, man, I hated you. And it's like, now I have to be your friend? It's like, what? But, you know, you realize, you know, after a couple of days or after a couple of weeks in camp, it's like, you know what? This is my teammate now. You know, whatever we had, wash it under the bridge. Let's move forward. Let's actually work on getting a different type of championship. Hey. I had to pull it up yet, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't want to hit nobody now. Watch out. Watch it down. Watch out. I didn't say Tobin. My nigga, Jesus. Hey, I'm going to take this up over here. <laughs> it was all fun and games for the Steelers players as they sat down with the media and conducted several interviews. However, the fun stopped when they hit the field behind me for their annual run test. Now, luckily, the rain held off for them, but unfortunately, I'm not so lucky. So reporting from St. Vincent College, I'm Justin Downs for Palester.net, the college network.